Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix. In the last episode, we revisited an old friend, or lots of old friends, back in Agrabah. Or I should just say in the last episode, we finished up our, our revisiting of Agrabah from the first game. But of course, we will be revisiting there once again later. But in the meantime, let's head to the next world. I know at the end of last episode, uh, Twilight Town reopened, but we don't need to go back there right now. We'll go back there eventually, just we won't go there right now. In the meantime, we gotta go to Broken go through the broken highway to get to the next world so we gonna do that right meow right quick right meow right quick right meow let's do it gotta love the shmuppage oh yeah gotta love that we have to do it every goddamn time it's kind of the best thing ever i know i know anyway i went ahead and picked the 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 uh level six falcon which we have yet to take for a spin to get for a spin a quick little spin you guys ready for this I'm ready to go to the next world man I'm ready I'm a, I'm a little sad that we're almost done going through all the worlds I mean like for the first time obviously like I said we're gonna revisit all of them it's gonna happen no doubt but I'm just sad cuz like oh well, we've almost seen all there is to see in terms of worlds in the game I mean, that's not really true, because every world we're going to go back to, it, it won't just be going back through the areas we've been before, and I don't really want to spoil anything other than that, but that's the beauty of what they do when they make you revisit the areas. It's just, there's so much more to the, the places that you just don't know about until you go back there the second time, and I, that's all I really want to say for now. I just wanted to point out that I am a little sad that we're already to this point. But I'm also happy because I feel like we've already been playing this game for a long time. Like this, I feel like we've already been doing this let's play for a while, and really, it hasn't really been that long. I mean, we've already been doing it for almost a month. Because I've been pretty diligent about doing this one daily. I usually am about non-blind LPs because it's easier for me to record episodes because I've played it before. Also, because usually I don't get stuck on anything and I'm not busy wandering around wasting time. I'm usually always making progress on a blind on a non-blind let's play not that I don't make not that there's a lot of blind episodes of uh, blind episode a lot of episodes of blind let's plays that where I do nothing but there are quite a few where there's a lot of waste of time happening so I mean Final Fantasy 15 is probably a good example of that lots of wandering in that so far not that that's a bad thing the game is beautiful and we sh it should be wandered around and explored that's kind of what should do in a big open world game like that. So you won't always make a lot of forward progress in every episode if you're doing a let's play of it. It's certainly true of my let's play of it so far. Why are we talking about this? I don't know. I'm babbling because this garbage, not that this is garbage, but you know what I mean. I'm just babbling because what else am I supposed to talk about while I'm shooting things? And it's really not worth commenting on specifically. <coughs> Shooting and shooting and killing and exploding and shooting. Oh look, the wheel thing's back. So scary. Oh no. Don't let him hurt you. Stop. Stop bouncing around, you piece of shit. I can't hit you. Bouncing around like an asshole. Like an asshole. Am I supposed to shoot him in the eyeball that pops out? I think that's exactly what I'm supposed to do. Let's see if we can blow this motherfucker up before the stage ends very similar to the one that led us to Agrabah. We had to fight basically one of these, but on a, we were fighting him on the road the whole time until he blew up. I just don't know if we're going to make it. One can't hope. Keep firing away, man. Keep firing away. I don't think I got him. No. Definitely did not kill him fast enough. If you kill him faster, I believe we would have got an item out of him. Oh, well. At least the route is open and we can go on to the next world of Disney. The next one's not really a Disney world. I, I wouldn't consider the next one a Disney world. Even though it's owned by Disney these days, sure. It's definitely not a Disney movie. That's why it makes it an interesting inclusion into the original Kingdom Hearts game, let alone this game. Now, like, it almost makes sense in this game, but in the last game it was like... Really? This world is in the game? That's pretty sweet. It wasn't a bad thing, it just surprised me, because in a good way. I was like, cool. 
I was thinking like it was a third party thing, but not not really. This is just a property that is owned by Disney now. Let's go ahead and land in Halloween Town, baby. Halloween Town. We already been here before, but there's a little bit different uh what do you call it? I don't even know, aesthetic to the to the what the what the uh, world looks like on the map. It looked like there was more to it than just the pumpkin land. And already, I see we're in the middle of some scary looking forest. <laughs> There's Jack! Hey Jack, what are you doing? What are you doing? What? Uh oh, he found something. It's a Christmas tree! On a tree! That tree on tree action! And what? It's a door? Where does the door lead? Dun 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 no. Oh no, Jack, come back! Whatever will we do without you? Well, don't know what happened to Jack, but we're back in Halloween Town, babies! Do we get to have the cool... Yes, we do! The alternate outfits. There they are. Hey, this is Halloween Town, right? Well, it sure does look like Halloween. Uh, what? What? Uh, what? Uh, what? 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 Why are you so surprised? Wow! <laughs> hey! Hey, it's zero. Zero. How have you been, boy? You didn't have anything left to do in the Mega Man X, eh? You just decided to show up in Kingdom Hearts. Got it. Not the right zero, I know. Alright, so here we are in Halloween Town again. Welcome back, guys. It's a little bit different of an area that we were in, but of course it has the same aesthetic. Um, I'm just looking around to see if there's any other items laying around here. I don't think we want to go this way yet. No, we gotta follow zero. Zero! Where'd you go, zero? Zero! To hero. Can we go in here? I guess maybe later. The fact that the, door, the gate is chained shut means it could be unchained and open later. This is Zero's grave. It's, seems he usually is sleeping here. This is true, but he's not there now. He went this way. So let's follow the dog. Here, lassie boy. Here, little Jack fell in the well. I like how I just started recording and I'm already yawning. Good lord, man. Don't be a lazy. Uh -huh. Hello? Anybody here? This doesn't look... I mean, it looks like What's Halloween, but something about this looks a little different. It's Jack! Hey, oh, what the... Oh, boy. Jack, Jack, Jack. What has the Christmas tree done to you, sir? Oh, boy. Sora, Donald, and Goofy! Hey, hey, Welcome hey. Welcome back. And Merry Christmas! What? Merry Christmas? What are you even Don't talking you mean about, happy dude? Happy Halloween? Of course! Halloween greetings from Jack Skellington, the Pumpkin King! Grr. Forgive me, I'm in a Christmas mood. You see, I'm running the show again this year, but I need Sandy Claus blessings, so I'm off to Christmas Town. Look, Sandy Claus. Sandy Claus? Sandy oh, Pinky Claus? means Santa Claus. Oh, duh. Aren't these decorations wonderful? This year, Halloween Town's going to handle Christmas, too. Um, but I'm first, not sure that's a good idea. We have to visit Sally. She's working on something no self-respecting Santa Claus can do without. Come along, I'll show you. Okay. A Halloween Town Christmas. Doesn't sound like a great idea, but you know. Yeah. <laughs> Wanna go check it out? <laughs> Wanna go check it out? It sounds cute, dude. And then, meanwhile, all the kids are like, "No, Come on, say it hurry. ain't so, Sandy Claus. Say it ain't so. Where's all the toys? Where's the reindeer? Not the undead reindeer. The real reindeer." <laughs> Anyways, guys, there it is. Welcome officially back to Halloween Town. Slash Halloween Christmas Town, apparently. Now we're getting into the real plot of the actual 
Nightmare Before Christmas movie, which is kind of cool. Because the first game only touches upon the actual story. This game's going to kind of complete most of that, what, like, what was missing from the first game. Kingdom Hearts, that is. I mean, they're still playing This Is Halloween, the song, so, Hello, I mean, Doctor, it's still Sally? Halloween, right? And you Quit scratching your brain, I'm son. In the of an experiment. No, you're just sitting there in your chair reading a book. That's not an experiment. Anyway, what are you doing? Of course, these bitches are here. What are you good bitches doing? What the hell is that? That looks like a heartless, actually. Oh, hey, it's Sally. Hey, girl, how you doing? Your stitches are hey, looking particularly uh, not gross today. You do, and you'll be sorry. Now bring it over here. <laughs> you'll be sorry. Yeah. Looks like a part of a heartless. Oh, oh no, it blew up. <sighs> How hum. <laughs> of course, these kids are laughing their asses off. Little punk asses. Imbeciles! Now my experiment is ruined! You bitches! <laughs> Sally, did you finish it? I want to show my good friends. I'm sorry, Jack. I, I need a little bit more time. Oh. Well, that's all right. Just as long as it's ready for Christmas. But, Jack... I'd best be off. I've got to go get Sandy Claus right away. Wonderful to see you again. Goodbye for now. Ta-ta for now. Go All get right. Santa Claus. Please, Sora. I'm afraid something terrible will happen if Jack goes through with this. You can try that again. Sora? Christmas will be ruined. The hell is Sora thinking Are those about that? Fellows in the town square face. with you? Huh? What fellows? You know, the ones who wanted to spoil Halloween and Christmas? What are they called again? Heartless? They're definitely not with us. But Donald, Goofy, and I can get rid of them for you. And then we can go see Santa. Oh my god. <laughs> what? But first, the Heartless. <laughs> what? I just want to hang out with Santa Claus. It's every child's dream. Am I right? I know I'm right. Um, you know, I'm gonna stick with Donald for now. Maybe we'll get a chance to use some of that wisdom. Some, a little bit of that wisdom skill, you know. Got a few of these AP boosts we want to use real quick, though. A few of these AP boosts, and... I think that's all, really. Okay. Uh, okay. And let's check out the abilities real quick, because we got this finishing leap after the last battle we did in the last episode. Unleashes a powerful guard piercing attack at the end of combo. Fuck yeah, it sounds amazing. Do it. That's a 5 AP ability, though. That's a lot. That's asking a lot. Increases the amount of time the summon will stay. That sounds amazing if I actually start using summons usefully. But it's good for now. Jack doesn't matter. Everything's good. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Donald now has Blizzard, though, huh? Hmm. Hmm. Um. I don't know if we'll need Blizzard here. We'll see. If I see a lot of fire enemies, maybe I'll put Blizzard on. Limit command that unleashes Goofy and yeah, as a joint attack. <sighs> I'm still yawning. Good lord, man. I think I need to get, um... Hold on a second. Did status have a new on it? What the hell? Oh. Is it because I actually used some? No, because we have Genie now. Okay. I was confused why there was a new thing there. Anyway, what was I going to say? I was going to say something about something. I sidetracked myself. Uh, oh, I, I was thinking about it. Maybe I should use some of those AP boosts on Donald and Goofy. I don't know. I mean, I know I've done that before in a play, my playthrough of this, but, like, it seems more reasonable, or at least useful, to just keep giving it to Sora so he can just keep using everything. But really, if you're not trying to do a little bit of everything, you don't really need everything. So anyway, Jack wants to become Sandy Claus, and if you could tell, apparently Sally's sewing a red... I don't know, clothing piece? Possibly for Jack. He did say, ask if it was finished yet. So, I don't know. Anyway, let's go merc some Heartless, because that is what we do. That is what we do. 
and then go see Sandy Claus. Oh yeah. Oh look, and it's the mayor. Now hear this, you you fiends! Leave Halloween Town at once, by order of the mayor. By order of Jack, the mayor. Where are you? I'm only an elected official. I can't handle this by myself. No one's asking you to, dude. Jack. Where I, are you? I seriously just yawned again. That happened. <sighs> all right. Well, we got the yawn counter at three right now. Cause good lord. Anyway, defeat all the heartless. All right. Let's do. It. Let's do. It. Let's start by wisdom form. So one thing somebody called me out on on the Wisdom Form is I like how he's using Wisdom Form but not using any magic because that's the magic form and I'm like, okay, well that's true. So I mean, I can't, I can't deny that. It's definitely true that that happened. And you know what? Because you said it, you made me go, okay, fine. You know what? I'll use some magic then. Because, whoops, I haven't been using it. I'm not going to argue the point because it's true, I haven't been using it. Hey, look, we even got a wisdom form up. So worth it, right? Worth it. I'll take it. All right, I'm happy with how that went. We got a level up out of it. it. Means it was worth it. All right, so let's just smack the rest of these bitches like with the, you know, how we do. Pick up this limit drive orb while we're at it. Ow. Get the He's gonna drop again so quickly. But the guillotine always drops. Are we supposed to beat the fuck out of this fountain or something? This fountain moving around and shit. Please cut it. Please like, stop moving around and shit, sucker. Is that it? Nope. Nice. Oh, I see the fountain spitting out like some poison water bullshit. Don't get in the way of that. Anyway, we murked all them heartless. Yo. How is Sandy Claus supposed to relax with all this going on? That's it, fellas. Sandy Claus needs bodyguards. Are you up to the task? Us? Yeah! Woohoo! Uh, you, um, no? What are we talking about? Are we talking about you, or are we actually talking about the real Santa Claus? Still confused. Still confused. Sally said he wants to become Santa Claus, but, I mean, what well, I, I don't know. I just stopped being so vague, like people don't already know where this is going. Anyway, here are these little bitches again. What are you guys doing? What should we bring along next time? A bucket full of caterpillars! Or something even worse! Buckets of caterpillars aren't that bad. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! Who's that? Some old hag? Silence. Ooh, called her old a and a hag. Owned. Hmm. Perhaps you three could be of use to me. Come along, all of you. I'll show you the true meaning of mischief. Well, now we know who's trying to ruin Christmas and Halloween. God damn it. She's full of malficience. What a bitch. I don't remember right, seeing her in this world, but hey, Christmas whatever. There's a lot of things this about this game I don't remember that clearly. In the woods just past the graveyard. Okay, then I guess we're going through the doorway in the woods just past the graveyard. Alright. And on our way there... Actually, before we head on our way there, we gonna take that energy shard. Um, anything going on around here? Not particularly. All right. I believe that's the building we came out of. This door is interesting because it keeps swinging open and smacking you if you get in the way. That's annoying. Closed. Oh, jeez. All sorts of hazards going on around here, man. It's just dangerous. Get out of here before something murders me. It's not even a sentient being, it's just a bunch of things that are going awry and trying to kill me. You didn't try to kill me. You got more? You got more? You got more where that came from? Yeah? Oh, damn, we could wreck the shit out of those guys. Damn. What level am I, by the way? I have not been keeping track of my level. I am um, not journal. Not journal status. I don't even need to go status. 25, which means I should probably go back and do the Olymp uh, well, it's not the Olympus Coliseum. We should go back to Olympus Coliseum and try out, uh, the first cup again. I was gonna wait till we got to about 25, and I kinda, just kinda wanted to keep rolling through this stuff. But I'm pretty sure by finishing up Halloween Town here, this world, we will unlock, remember how we need the man magnet spell to go back to Atlantica to make more progress? 
I think we're gonna go ahead and go back there because I think after this world we'll have the magnet spell. I believe this is where we will obtain it. So I'll probably head back to Atlantic after this and it's not really a side thing because you do have to finish all the worlds to progress through the game. But yes, Atlantica, we know it's all about the stupid rhythm fucking mini game. We have to go back and do some more of that shit. But at the very least, we can do that in an episode where I actually go back and do the Coliseum as well. We'll do that all in one episode, hopefully. Obviously, I'll do Atlantica first, so I don't know how long that'll take. But I, I should hope that I can fit in a, a run through the lowest level of the Coliseum. Uh, in the meantime, here's the door to Christmas. But before we do that, check this shit out. There is other doors here as well. There's a door to... Can you guess what holiday that is? I believe that's 4th of July. The Red Heart is probably Hall uh, Halloween. Valentine's Day. The uh, Green Shamrock, that would be St. Patty's Day. Then we have the decorative egg for Easter. And of course, the turkey for Thanksgiving. Very interesting. I think, I'm, I'm, I tried to, I haven't seen Nightmare Before Christmas in a long time actually. But I don't remember if all these doors exist in that. I'm pretty sure they have this Christmas door. Because the plot of Nightmare Before Christmas is pretty is. much the plot the of what we're about to, to see now. here. Jack wants to throw Christmas. Of Halloween he's enamored so by it. year after year. I wanted something new, and I found this. Okay. Beyond this door is a world filled with wonders, the kind of wonders. Of which you've never seen. Oh yeah. At first, I couldn't believe my eyes. God, Everything Sora. Everything so fresh and exciting. So fucking. Come on, just open it. <laughs> Sora, stop being such an antsy pants. Yeah! Sora's like, yeah, I'm going now. See ya. I don't think you have a choice, Donald. Yeah. Don't think you have a choice. Yeah. Well, I guess it's not Halloween tell anymore. Oh, yeah. Okay, what was that? You on four or you on five? I lost track. It's definitely on four at least. Let's keep it at four for now. Good lord, man. Why am I yawning so much? God, so lazy. It's crazy how lazy. Anyway, check out the face on that pump pumpkin. Hey, hey, hey. And look at we even changed our outfits. That's pretty cool. I didn't remember that. Cool. That certainly makes sense. <laughs> cool. <laughs> Donald's a snowman. That's awesome. And Goofy is some kind of decorated tree. Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer or some shit. I don't even know. And of course there's Jack who just looks like Jack. In his workshop. Because he's Jack. And why would you give him a different outfit? That doesn't make any sense. Shall we? We're in the North Pole and we're going to hang out with Sandy Claus at his workshop. Every child's dream come true. Wow, he's like, he is a reindeer. Ooh. Fucking Rudolph. Goodolf. Ah, uh, I said it. I said it. Anyway, I like the designs of their their outfits. I didn't remember them having new outfits here. I guess I didn't forget it. I just didn't think about it. All right, so let's check this out. See if there's anything new to synthesize it. Oh yeah, got a Serenity Stone. So, any recipes? No new recipes. So we got that free development, though. We could make a Garnet Ring, or we could make a Mithril Ring. Can we make both? No, we do not have the Power Stones to make both. We have Power Stones to make one. So choose wisely. I will choose... Wait, no. I take that back. I have enough to make both. What am I even saying? Make both, bro. Increase the Moogle level. We'll do that. Uh, that's fine. Just, just do that. Synthesize it. All right, so we got a garnet ring and me thrill ring. Let's go ahead and do both. Why not? It's all I can do anyway, so we might as well level up my Moogle a little bit. You know what I'm saying? I think that sounds like a fantastic idea. You know what I'm saying? All right, anything else I can make that's cool? Not really. Okay. Uh, we're done here then. What can you buy? I didn't even check the shop. I just went ahead and synth first. Bunch of new rings. Um, I just synth some better rings than these, I think. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. This one gives me strength, and this one gives me magic. This one gives you just just AP. There's no reason to buy the technician's ring. Not really. Um. 
I don't know. Should I buy these or no? I'm going to look at my rings real quick. All right. I'm going to spend a minute here doing item management. The best of all the things. Serenity Stone. Okay. So, Sora. Did we get a new weapon from the last world? I don't think we got a weapon from Agrabah. We did not. Um, let's see. No. So I have this extremely increases AP, and I have this increases strength and increases max AP. But I just made this one, which is fantastic. I'm going to go and put that one on. Hell yeah. And then Jack, you don't get shit. Donald, however, I do have a magic one now, right? Yeah, see, this one is the other one that I just made, which is fantastic. And we'll just leave that alone, because Goofy could use one, too. I gotta have one that gives him more AP than what I'm giving him right now, right? No? Apparently not. I have all the extremely ones being given to Donald and freaking Sora. The other annoying thing is Goofy can only have one goddamn... One goddamn accessory. I don't know if he's gonna increase that at some point. He probably will. I just don't remember when or where or how. Wait, did I give them all their better weapons? Did I? I must have. All oh, there's two people. Wait, Falling Star is better for attacking, yet Chain Gear is better for defense. You know, stick with the defense one for now. Okay, done looking at this, I think. Uh, abilities, Sora, what do you have? Did you get another ability or what? Auto Wisdom? Oh, he got Auto wi Oh, Auto Wisdom because we went up a level. Drive Boost. Oh. Huh. Last Greater Restoration. Uh, quit more to increase effect. That sounds kind of cool, but I don't think I'm going to worry about that right now. You definitely would want that on if you were trying to grind your, uh, your forms, but at this point we're not trying to grind. We do have 3 AP to work with, though, so let's put something on. Um, maybe I will put Drive Boost on. Shit, I don't really know what else I would want to put on out of these things that I can afford. Yeah, pretty much. There's not really a whole lot here I want to put on. So fuck it. Put Drive Boost on. Seems helpful when it comes to wanting to do Drive things. It'll just boost our Drive more often. Okay, where are we at on time? Uh, we can keep going for a minute. Jack, what are you doing? What do you think of the view? Impressive, right? None of this is in Halloween Town. Now then, Santa Claus's house is just up ahead. We should get moving. Okay, let's get moving then. Santa Claus, we're here to wreck Christmas. Sorry, not sorry. It's alright. If the episode goes a little bit long, it's fine. It's fine. Make sure we get through Halloween slash Christmas Town in a timely manner. Of course there's Heartless here too. Freaking Christmas theme Heartless, the best. This should be fun. Let's murder some fancy ass Christmas Jack in the Box. Ooh, that sounds good. Some Jack in the Box right now, and I mean by that I mean some fucking fast food Jack in the Box. That actually sounds quite delectable right about now. Right about now. That sounds delicious right about now. Sounds right delicious right about now. Uh, spin, spin, spin. Oh, we're spinning. Oh, that spin? Oh, that's interesting. Did that actually help us? I think it actually knocked this thing on its ass, so that's nice. But I got fucking floaty combos for days right now, so we're good. Look at that. Damn, my air combo is bitching right now. So you got a whole nother jack in the crack. Yeah, see, this thing should not be here in Christmas Town. I mean, look at this thing. It's a jack in the box that literally has a fucking pumpkin, evil pumpkin inside. That's not very Christmassy. That's not very in the spirits of the holidays. Just, well, at least not these holidays. This is kind of an appropriate world to be doing right now, too. I mean, we're a little bit, like, early for Christmas, like, by about three weeks, but still. Feels appropriate. Feel, I'm glad we're getting to this before. Or I should have. No, you know what? I could have saved this episode all the way until Christmas. Oh, that would have been unrealistic. Unrealistic. Christmas is a big yeah, there's Heartless all up in this. We can't let anything bad happen to Christmas. No siree. Something happens to Christmas, then we got to murder Jack over That's here, where Sandy ruining Claus lives. it. Guess who brought all the Heartless? Remember who opened the door? Yeah, exactly. This place was probably peaceful as fudge before Jack walked up in here all like, Hey, what's going on in this door? Anyway, you probably saw all these Christmassy looking treasure chests sitting around. 
Yep, everything here is all super themed out. I love it. I love it. Kinda cool. I like how everything's kinda buried in snow too. So realistical. Door is locked! No more locked doors! Stop locking all the doors! The gate's been raked shut to prevent the sleigh from being stolen. No one can steal Santa's sleigh. No one. How dare you even think it possible to try. Anyway, let's go visit Mr. Sandy Claus himself, huh? 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 Oh, Mr. Nicholas! I'm here to see you! Am I on the naughty or the nice list? Hey, speak of the devil! Looking at the list right now. Oh! Well, hello everyone. Did you come to see if you're on my nice list? That's exactly what I came here for. How did you know? You read my mind. Your name? Um, Sora, sir. Let's see. Sora. Not on the list. Yes. Well, according to my list, Sora, seven years ago, you told everyone you did not believe in Santa Claus. Owned. Ooh, that is unfortunate. Uh, no, I never said that. No, it didn't happen. <laughs> I just realized Donald's arms are sticks also to go along with the snowman thing. Woohoo! Am I on your list too by any chance? It's no, Jack. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> oh, God. What are you doing here, Jack? Hey, Mr. Jack. What sort of trouble did you bring this time? Yeah, see, this time. This time? It's a long story. Hey, we're old friends. You know, we hang out, play some part cheesy over a cup of hot cocoa. You know, see, here's the part cheesy thing on the table. No? Okay. Anyway, the merry-go-round is function malfunctioning due to a lightning strike. Now it's dangerous. Oh, is that why the merry-go-round's dangerous? Because okay. of a lightning strike? Okay. Anyway, here's the map of Christmas Town. Also, apparently, Santa's hoarding puzzle pieces for my freaking puzzles, man. Hoarding them, I say. Probably packed with Santa's red outfits, because he only wears red. Don't you know this? Fills the room with cozy warmth. Doesn't this room just feel so fanciful? And full of treasures. AP boosting. Yeah, yeah. We go, um... Oh, shit. I didn't mean to leave the room. No, go back. I was going to call it an episode right there, actually. Hold on. We're going to have more cutscene, aren't we? I think we are. Okay, more cutscene. Hold on. Oh. Looks like a, uh, what, a present factory or so of some sort? Something some, something wrong, Santa? Uh, Why do we have to hide? Oh, no. Silence. Oh, no. Well, this is a pleasant surprise. That fool Jack brought Sora and the others with him. Now we can deal with all of them at once. What that do you fool! Want us to do? Who's there? Busted! Who there? Who there? What, you, what the? Okay, well. Oh! Oh! There's your trouble, Sandy. Somebody broke it's your window. Lock, shock, and barrel. What are what they those doing? Three? They're on the naughty list the every year. Well, whatever the case, they've been quite naughty. Catch them and bring them back here. They're going to get a lecture. From good old Sandy Claus himself. Uh, Mr. Claus, I wanted to talk to you about Christmas first. It'll have to wait. I need to see how things are progressing in my workshop. And here you thought Santa Claus was Come off on, Jack, limits for a Let's catch those little pranksters. <laughs> oh, all right then. Okay. Can I save and quit first, and then we'll do that next time? Because I didn't even mean to go into the workshop in the first place. Aw, oh, man, really? <sighs> the little bastards. Oh, I'm not following that. You can't make me follow that, not if I don't want to. You can't make me if I don't wanna. I'm going back inside. Screw that. Yeah, that's right, Santa. We're not done raiding your house yet, buddy. We're not done. Not by a long shot, sir. Not by a long shot. Actually, we are done, at least for the episode. So, uh, oh, there's some elves chilling here, too. I mean, we're talking to the factory about to run off somewhere. I doubt they could have got far. Maybe we'll let it go inside. Outside. Blah, blah, blah. 
Why would anyone do such a horrible thing? I hope Danny gives him a good time, too. Meh, meh, meh. Okay, elves. Okay. Anyways, that's going to do it for today's episode of Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix. In the next one, we will follow Lock, Shock, and Barrel, see what the hell they're doing here with Malficient, and uh, see if the rest of the plot of Nightmare Before Christmas plays out as I think it does. So I will see you guys next time. Peace!